Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe After Effects tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to add text behind a subject, or an object, or a person, or anything. A thing just like this. Let me show you what I got here. I'll hit spacebar. And presto, we've got good boy. We've got this puppy dog coming in and doing his thing, looking in a mirror, and the text is behind him. Let me show you the original shot. This is what we got to begin with. And then, like I showed you, what we had there at the end. How did I do it? Nice and simple. Let's start from scratch. Here we go. Okay, I'm just going to do a short clip here because there is a little bit of rotoscoping going on and it takes some uh, resources, uh, quite a bit of resources, so it's just going to be a short clip, okay? First step here, we're going to go ahead and add our footage in like I've done. Now we're going to go up and edit and we're going to click duplicate, so we've got two layers. Let's turn the bottom layer off so we're working on the top layer to begin with. Okay, the next step is you want to go up to the top here and you'll see a roto brush tool. This is the one we want. Make sure your playhead is at the beginning or wherever you want the rotoscoping to begin. And now double click on the video and this is going to take you to the layer panel or the source panel. Now, making sure that you've got roto brush, roto brush selected like I have here. Roto brush, what the heck is that? Roto brush selected, I'm going to go ahead and paint all over the poppers. Just like this and watch what happens. It's selecting his body and we're just going to get it in. There we go, but there's a little bit of stuff that I don't want so I'm going to hold down the alt or the option key, uh, depending on if you're on a PC or a Mac. And I'm just gonna cut out some of this stuff by basically just drawing a line over what I don't want. So this looks pretty good. It's not quite perfect, but it's getting there. And I'll just cut this out. And I'll move in a little bit closer and cut that. Okay, good enough for now. Maybe I'll take the front face. Okay, good. Now, what you wanna do is you just wanna move your playhead forward, like I'm doing here. And just check to make sure that the purple parts are correct. So you've got the uh, subject or the object in like this part here. It's broken. So I'm just going to just scooch over that just like that. And I'm going to get that part there as well. Now I'm going to move forward a frame or two. Let's go a frame. Okay, this is looking pretty good. 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 This is looking pretty good actually. So we've done a pretty good job. Roto Brush 2.0, the new version, is absolutely bonkers inside after effects so you see what we're doing here we're just basically going through and anytime you see a, a frame that's missing something let's see if i can find one um no this is pretty darn good i'm not gonna lie about it there we go okay yes this frame right here we didn't catch this part of the tail so i'm gonna go and just zip that in and this part's too much so i'm gonna take that out and then i'm gonna move forward a frame good 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 okay good this is how you do it now now that we've done that now what we're going to do is we're going to go back to the composition. Watch this. And when I go back to the composition, you're going to see that this is all the back. The background is black now. That basically means we've taken it out. Now what you want to do is you want to turn the old one back on as well. So you've got both loaded. So you've got the bottom and the top. The next step is you want to go up here to the text tool. Click on the type tool or the text tool. And then write in whatever you want it to say. I want it to say good boy. Okay, good stuff. I'm just going to go over to the selection tool and I'm going to center it ish, maybe somewhere around there. And then presto. Now, if I move forward, we're not quite there, but we're getting close. Okay. Maybe I'll move it to the right a bit. Now, the next step is you want to take that text, put it between the two videos. This is now a sandwich. And now watch what we've got. I'll hit spacebar. Hey, yo. We've rotoscoped it in. The pupper dog is there. This looks great. This is how you do it inside Adobe After Effects, real quick. Thanks for watching. Ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned.